In this video, we're going to teach you how to create cinematic explosion in video. Hey everyone, welcome to the Filmora MVP YouTube channel. Here we teach you editing tricks, filmmaking, and camera techniques. So make sure you subscribe to our channel and also hit the notification bell to get updates on our new videos. Before we start editing, click the download link in the description box, click on the free download option. Now a Filmora installer is downloaded automatically. Just double click on it, agree with the terms, and here you go! Filmora started to download and install. Once it's installed, it'll start and run automatically. First, drop your video on the timeline and take a snapshot. Next, we need to customize the mask in Photoshop. Import the snapshot and use the lasso tool to outline the part we need. Remove the rest of the part, fill it in black color, and save it. Then go back to Filmora, double click on your clip, go to the video mask section, import the mask we have just created. Add mask keyframe at the beginning of the clip, then go to 1 second and change horizontal to 103, move to 3 seconds and change horizontal to 106. Copy this clip and paste it on track 4. Select first clip and turn on invert mask. Now let's shrink both clips to 5 seconds and 10th frame. Go find Blockbuster Explosion and Explosion Volume 2 under Elements and download these two amazing packs. In these packs, you will get Nuke Explosion, Aerial Explosion, and more. Download these packs from Filmstock. Drop Explosion 35 at 10th frame. Keep it as long as the video clip. Then go to the video. Here you can adjust its position as you like. You can also add some effect to the explosion by selecting Preset in the Advanced Panel of Color section. Now we drop another small explosion clip on track 2 at 1 second position. Reduce its duration, double click on it, and adjust its position. Then go to the color, click on Advanced, and apply the fantasy effect. To make the explosion vision more real, we need to create a reflection in the water. Copy the track 3 clip and paste it on track 5 at the 10th frame. Go to the video and flip vertically. Decrease the scale. Move its position to match the explosion and change blending mode to overlay. Meanwhile, reduce the opacity to 55. Here we use a mask on the reflection. When it's done, right click on it and copy effect. Copy track 2 clip and paste it on track 6 at 1 second. Then right click on it and select paste effects and adjust its position. Now we're going to add a few effects so that all clips look similar. Use 80mm film grain effect and dark film effect on track 7 and 8. Shaking effect helps the vision more complete, so we drop the extreme shake effect at the 15th frame and keep the effect 2 seconds long. Double click on it and change the frequency to 10. Finally, apply the cinematic bars and click on render preview for smooth playback. This is how you can add explosion VFX in your videos using Filmora. Go to Filmstock and check out these effects. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, then give this video a thumbs up. Plus, subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon, but don't leave without sharing this video and leave your comment below. Bye!